Today's task is backing up your files in the cloud using OneDrive. That is to say, we're going to make a copy of your files in the internet. This helps to protect your files when you swap out machines or turn it in at the end of the year. Our first step is to log in to Office 365. Use Safari for this, since 365 works best in Safari. Navigate to login dot Microsoft Online dot com. Remember that for students, your credentials are similar to your Mac credentials, except that you have an SD7 in front of your PowerSchool password. The tab we're looking for after logging in is OneDrive. OneDrive is the service for our cloud storage. You may be asked to trust a SharePoint plugin. We do want to accept that plugin. OneDrive has drag and drop functionality and can accept just about any file type. If I have a file I want to save in OneDrive, on my desktop, or in Finder, I just need to drag them to the Safari window. The green dot means I will make a copy in the internet once I release them from my drag. After uploading, I will see the files in OneDrive. Dragging entire folders does not work in OneDrive. You'll need to create folders first and then drag items into these folders. Create a new folder by clicking on the New Document button and then click on New Folder. Once your folder is created, you can simply click on it and drag files into that folder. Here's a helpful tip. You can hold down the Command key, click on multiple files, and then drag all of those files into OneDrive. There are some file types you may want to back up in different ways. For iMovie projects, export the final project first as a movie. Then drag that exported movie to OneDrive. To keep the entire project, including the original timeline and clips, you're going to want to use a flash drive. More on that some other time. Thanks for watching this video tutorial. For more tips and tricks, check out 7ignites.com.